Hey, before the video starts, I just want to say thank you to everyone who checks out my videos. Your clouds absolutely kill the views every time I make a video. I honestly, I honestly can't get enough of it every time I put a dose of my love into a video. Boom. 100 plus nutritional views. We're growing as a whole, and I can't wait to see what type of plant we'll become. But, enough of my ramblings. I bring you Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Enjoy the video, and make sure to like and subscribe if you're new. Hit that subscribe button and become a cloud. As for those who already subscribed, thank you all so much for all your love and support. I love you clouds so much for being so active on the channel. We're up 3,000 views. Okay, I'll oh, go quiet now. Shh, it's beginning. Look at the size of this beautiful creature. Impressive, isn't it? Clear eyes, strong haunches. It must come from powerful stock. You fools. It could swallow the moon next month if it continues to grow like this. I know your mind, Javi, but this wolf is not your enemy. The signs of Ragnarok, when it comes, will be clear for all to see. Tyr, you roll bones in a game you do not understand. That may be, but I'll assume the risk. If there's a price to be paid, I'll pay it. It's the Jotnar that trouble us now. Have you spoken with the Builder? The Builder, yes. Is Freya nearby? She's teaching Thor about organizing armies. A battle they're both losing. Come along then. You must all hear what I have to say. You spoke with the Builder. You saw his work. I did. And the sacred water, was it put to use? It was. Your tongue is shorter than your temper today, Harvey. Indeed. These markings are your warriors. Now here we have the four corners of the sky. Enough of this sorcery, woman. Just point me towards the enemy and I will handle them. Harvey, you look troubled. The Builder gave me a demonstration of his magic. He conjured a shield that killed invaders on contact. That would do well for us. But your expression says otherwise. I fear the price is too high. What does he want? You. Me? Does he take us for slavers? I will smash his skull till he shits out brains! Now hold on, everyone. Let's weigh the- Do not finish that thought. What was your reply? I told him it was your choice alone. You didn't refuse him outright? For good reason. If the Builder believes he has a chance, he will continue his labors. A dog will not keep working for the mere promise of a bone. How about I beat on his liver till he builds us a wall for free? Might we consider... I will not barter with my body. That would be a first. Hold on. I've got it. The blunt end of my hammer on his family stones. You are overthinking this, all of you. Give this builder an impossible task, a deadline of, say, nine days. When he forfeits, as he no doubt will, Freya remains free, and we may finish his work as intended. He would be mad or stupid to agree. You underestimate men of intellect, Lord of Storms. The Builder is a proud man. He won't back down from a challenge. I do not like this. Nor do I, but we must act. Loki, bring this offer to the Builder. Your will is my deed, Rune Writer. You grapple with forces outside your control. You were eager to see the deal done. We're acid. She's Vanna. Watch out! Keep your distance! I've warned you well, and look where it has led! Harvey, stop! Stay, your ex! my way, Loki! <sighs> you 
You swore an oath to never spill my blood. Step aside, and I won't have to. This is my blood! What? He is my son! Bastard! Dear, you've cared for this wolf. You will be his jailer. Take it to Lingby. Find it there. Make sure it never leaves the island. I can speak with the Dwarf Ivaldi. May he find a more permanent solution. Come, boy. You're safe with me. Be kind, Justice Pringle. Loki, there will be a reckoning. Of this, I have no doubt. Harvey, tell this rump cloud he can't... I was only curious, Dwarf. I meant no offense. I'm merely a seeker of knowledge. The Dwarves give nothing away for free. Apologies for the distraction, Master Blacksmith. I'll leave you to your work. Well, what shall I craft for you today, High One? Bottomless breaches for soiling yourself on the battlefield? What were you and the Builder discussing? Harvey, my gentle jailer. You know we dwarves give nothing away for free. If you want your question answered, I'll need something in return. Such as? A hidden fact known only to you, Farseer. That I may share in your secret knowledge of the world. The humans will survive Ragnarok in force. Taking shelter in Hutimir's forest. Eating morning dew until their race is renewed. The humans are a hearty people indeed. Much stronger than we give them credit for. So, you asked what that sack of sheep guts was after? He wanted to know how magic affected your Hooger. Why would he want to know the effect of magic on my spirit? Not just you, Harvey. The lot of you. Aesir and Vanir alike. I told him to shovel his shit somewhere else. Now if that's all you came to know, you can piss off and let me work. I have one more need. Can you forge me an unbreakable chain? Chains are overrated. One weak link and it's worthless. Let me craft the cord that Thor himself could not break. It must be strong enough to bind a powerful beast. I will sluice my sweat into this cord, Harvey. All knowledge I have and skill I own will define it. And what will I get in return? Make good on your claim, and your contract is fulfilled. I smell bait. What's the trap? No trap. No trickery. Forge me this cord, and you shall be free of my service. Hmm. To craft such a cord, I'll need a few impossible ingredients. Name them. I the list there. I have a bear's tendon, a fish's breath, and... A cat's footsteps? And the root of a mountain? How do I find these? How the fuck would I know? The riddles will guide you. I have no patience for riddles, Dwarf. Those riddles are as ancient as the world, with lore passed down from Nii and Nidi to Northri and Sudri, Austri and Vestri, Althjover. I understand. I will return shortly. Valin, Bevor, Babur, Bombur, Nori, An and Annar, Ai, Mjolvitnir, Veig, Gandalver. Bindalver, Drain, Deck, and Thorin, Thror. Bring it here. I found everything you asked for. 
How soon can you finish this unbreakable cord? As soon as it wants to be made. You cannot rush this kind of magic. It flows with a speed all its own. Find me as soon as it's ready. By the way, after we spoke of the Hooger, a cousin came by with his own spirit tale. I don't trust coincidence, so this one's free. What did he say? He told me his sister's husband, Borin, drank a mead brewed in Jotunheim, and it sent his Hooger into a goat. The spirit of a dwarf in the body of a goat? <laughs> Stranger still, his sister didn't even notice. Heavy! Don't drag me into this. The tower is nearly finished. Do not fret. The final hours are ticking down. Not fast enough. I feel the jaws of a trap closing upon me. Knowing you are in a trap is the first step to avoiding it. You don't care if I'm married off to this builder, do you? Have no fear, Freya. Whatever things transpire today, you marrying the builder will not be among them. At least have the sense to admit you betrayed my trust. I was wrong to use you like that. I will confront the Builder and pry the truth out of him. A limp apology, but it will suffice for now. Once the Builder is dealt with, turn your spear on Loki. Every chance he had, he dug us deeper into this mess. If Loki is up to something, I will see to it that he is punished. Blood Oath be damned. Not my best work, but it has a certain glow. Now then. Where's my queen? You're finished. The tower is functional. One rune remains, which I shall inscribe after I am wet. I don't want you building this path. Who helped you complete the work, Builder? You could not have managed so quickly on your own. Our agreement said nothing about outside help. Now, where is Frey? I tire of waiting. Outside help. Interesting choice of words. Hail, Harvey. Hail, Builder. We bring you your bride. What? Okay, let's go. Freya, my beloved. Why does she leer so wickedly? For God's pal. She agreed to marry you for the sake of Asgard, but she is not warmed by the idea. In fact, you revolt her utterly. If she hopes to dissuade me from this union, she'll be quite disappointed. I am committed to seeing this through. Enough chatter. We have upheld our end of the bargain. Will you finish your work? I'm sorry, but I've never seen such wild eyes. Why does she look so feral? We're God's power. Since hearing of your offer, she has not closed her eyes. She fears what she might miss in the abyss of comforting sleep. This is no dream, my love. It is all quite real. Speak and tell me you agree. Quit stalling and kiss her, dung meat! Consummate your this betrothal! Guy, yes, this guy's always a kiss. Ahead of his health. A brief taste to whet my appetite. He's like all in. I love Thor. <clears throat> yeah. Delicious! Your lips are two <laughs> pillows on a bed of rain rose petals. And yours are cold and rough as unpolished stone. What trickery what? is this? Is what something the wrong? Heck? Her voice! It's hideous! I have been told it has a seductive quality. By a wolf. Treachery! Bring me the real fray, or my offer is withdrawn! I'll bring myself, if you don't mind. Oh, shit. Freya, you don't need to... You have to... next to nothing, Esir. Only this useless monument to your ineptitude. Uh... You've been a good boy, Thor. Don't gamble your winnings. <clears throat> and you, Havi. Yes, my queen. You implied you had a plan. I hope with all my heart this wasn't it. 
Nah, it wasn't. That was their plan. I swear. You are no one's prize just yet. If this scheme turns sour, I will fight for you till my sinews snap and my bones break. Has this sad spectacle been for my sake alone? I've seen better drama on the festering carcass of a dead pig. Finish your work or suffer. No Freya, no shield. I'll just cut your head off, though. To hell I am with him, Harvey. I know where he keeps his enchanted paint. Show me. Show me. I need it. Thor, Tyr, watch our guest closely. Freya, I hope we will have words when this is done. Yeah. Why do you still wear Freya's form? A reminder of who's at stake. Change back. This is disturbing. Where do we go now? I don't know. I didn't say I was watching him every moment. So you do not know where he kept his supplies? They must be nearby. He never left this area. Mostly never. Come on. <clears throat> you survived my trap. How disappointing. Invaders from Jotunheim. We slaughtered them all. Who is Balsack? Can I kill him now? We do not need this honor cheat. We will complete the tower ourselves. My Hoover makes it work. I am bound to it through the magic of your realm. You perverted our sacred waters. We have every reason to kill you. Well reasoned. They should call you the god of hindsight. All knowing after the fact. <laughs> I will finish the inscription. Builder, you stay with me. You others go. Elhas, for protection. Where are you smirking at there, pal? Or you godless products. worm, slayer of my kin, oath breaker, spirit taker. I didn't build this tower to keep your enemies out. I built it to keep you in. Oh shit. You thought you could slay my people without punishment or price? You and error. your slab had its son. Their lives were the price of their arrogance. His head is exposed. Rigid. I have no arrows. I'm dead. Better move. <laughs> there, that was it. You do not control them. Control them? I only wish to survive them. Holy shit, you're right. Magic dies with him. Does that worry you, trickster? What are you implying? Were you behind this? You dishonorable truth tangler. What do you know of honor, Freya? You've bedded more men than all the halls in Midgard. You're a fine one to talk of sexual appetites. You fathered a wolf cub. I'll not hear a lecture from the Lord of Petty Rules who stiffens at the thought of laying down the law. And before you threaten to brandish your hammer, Thor, remember, without it, you'd be no better than a troll. Only twice as stupid. Oh, 
You festering ball sack swollen with the foulest drippings of Emir's corpse. No oath is worth this abuse. But you won't break it, Harvey. You cannot. All your efforts to evade destiny will only fling you further along its course. If you're not careful, you may be the author of your own destruction. <coughs> well, at least then I'll be the one to mess it up, right? Leave him. I won't be mad. He will do little harm while his son remains captive. A mouthful of iron would put a stop to his babbling. What now, wise one? We have returned to the place from which we set out. Ragnarok is coming, and we are no safer. There may be a solution in Jotunheim. Huga magic, they call it. I will travel there to see it for myself. Until I have the final binding, Lokistan must not leave that island. In time, it shall serve as a sanctuary for all wolves. I will watch over him, as one of my own kin. Then I'll leave the realm in your capable hands, my queen. If my own are empty when I return, I will accept destiny with both. The Nornir told me you'd be here. The cord is forged. Gleipnir, I call it. I'll wager there's a good story behind that wound. A tale for another time. Thank you for this. When you bind the beast, spare no loose ends. The cord will stretch or shrink to fit your needs. How tightly will it hold? The beast may resist. The more you tighten the cord, the stronger it will hold and the greater it will hurt, till the beast is rooted to the ground. Thank you, Ivaldi. You may go. You mean from Asgard, do you not? My debt to you is paid in full? Yes, as promised. Thank you, Harvey. I... Uh, I did not expect you to remember. Where will you go next? Under the mountains of Svatalpheim. Our mountains. To free the Earth's riches. For this is what I know best. That was the end of the first episode of Asgard. I really hope you guys liked it. If you did, like and subscribe, show me in the comments, and get ready for episode 2. It's on its way.